Hey guys, so starting today, December 30th, Hobby Lobby has their Christmas clearance stuff 80% off. So let me show you um, some of the stuff that my store still has. Here's a few pillows. Um, just little like figurine and sign stuff on the shelf. Lots of stuffed animals. Little like kitchen knickknack things. Christmas garland. I personally really love these, but I have no use for them, so I'm not getting any. But they're really cute. Different kinds of ornaments. Not as much as, you know, before, but still a good majority of different kinds. Lots of ornament sets. Here's like an outdoor decor thing. I don't know, I really like it. More of like the fancier boxed ornaments. Christmas cups. Lots of storage containers. I know people use these for like cookies and stuff. These are all 80% off. And dishware, like the good dishware. Um, I personally really like these. I didn't get any because I don't have any like, purpose for them, but they're like glass. They're really nice. But there's literally so many different like kinds of them. Um, I don't know. I personally got this one. Yes, here. Thank you. I can like pull it out. I got this one. These were like all glass and they're eighty percent off. And then these little knickknacks. I thought these were cute. They didn't have any Aussies because I wanted to get one for my dog, but there's no Aussies. Um, it's a cute little cat though, I almost got that one. Um, little like bowls, I like those. Put like cookies or something in them. In your kitchen, just little knickknack things. Tree skirt, more little knickknack things. Lots of different tools. Um, just more knickknack things, things that kind of just sit around for decoration. Some things are broke, which makes me really sad, but like this nutcracker, it's broke. Lots of Christmas bags and ribbons and bows. I'm not 100% sure what you would do with this, but I really like it. There's a couple of these here. And there are so many like little containers for presents like boxes and stuff, which is mainly what I got because I'm trying to go extra for presents next year. And then there's my cart. <laughs> I am showing you what I got at Hobby Lobby from their Christmas clearance. Um, I was there like right when they opened. There was already people just standing by the door just waiting for them to open the door, which was crazy to me. Like I got there at nine o'clock thinking that they were already open for like an hour. Um, it turns out they opened at nine o'clock. So, um, I went in there just like a few minutes after um, the people that were standing at the door went in there and they had a pretty good amount left over. Um, I was hoping to get some of the Grinch stuff that I saw whenever it was 66% off, but those that stuff was all gone. But I did get some really good stuff for next year. A lot of like gift wrapping. I have a whole bunch of boxes here. Um, so I'll show you everything that I got and I will tell you the prices so let's go okay I will start out with all of the boxes that I got because that was a big majority of what I got I want to actually show you all of them because a lot of them just look the same they're just different sizes but um so like I got some small ones none of the boxes that I got were more than two dollars so this was originally five dollars and fifty cents so it was like a dollar or something um there's these it was like a dollar something for these these were originally $7.99 I got two of those I got these little containers it kind of looks the same they're just little containers um these were originally $3.99 so those were super cheap I like these little boxes like I think of little kids whenever I think of this I'll probably put like some of the kids presents in it next year um, and these were originally six fifty, but they were like, like a dollar or something. Um, I got two of those, but they're like different sizes. So whenever I store them for next year, I'll just put them inside of each other. 
for storage. That makes it pretty easy. Same with these big circle ones that are behind me right here. So I have like three of them and they just fit inside of each other for storage purposes. But when it comes to like actual presents, they look really cool. And it has the same Santa Claus design on these. But the smallest one that I got was originally $7.99 and then they just kind of go up a little bit um, the bigger they are. I think the biggest one is originally $10.50 but like I said I didn't spend more than $2 on any of them and like I think it was like a maybe $1.80 for like the biggest one which I don't even know if you can buy it for that price at like Dollar General. But this was the other design it says Be Merry and I just think it's so cute. I ended up getting four of these in different sizes. And like I said, they just sit inside of each other. This is the smallest one, which was originally $6.50. That's the same price as So basically, I have no intention of wrapping presents next year as much as possible. Um, I also got these little bags to put gifts in for next year. This was, I don't even think this was a dollar. Um, it's originally $5.99, so maybe it was a dollar. Like, you know, whatever. And then I got um, this huge bow, which I'm actually using this year because I haven't finished Christmas shopping yet. So this is actually going to go on a Christmas present that I'm supposed to go get like this week. So this was only like a dollar. Um, actually, I don't know if actually that's a lie. There's a couple things I got for more than two dollars, but the majority of stuff that I got was just super cheap. Um, I had so much stuff in my car, I was afraid that I was going to go like way overboard on price. Plus it's Hobby Lobby. Like when you go in Hobby Lobby, you just kind of assume that you're going to spend a bunch of money. But um, I ended up spending everything you're going to see in this video was $41 altogether. So um, I felt like it wasn't that bad with what I got a cart full of stuff, like everything in here. Like I was, the cart was overflowing. Can I help you? I also got a bunch of um, like ribbon tool stuff. Well, this isn't tool, but ribbon. And they had a bunch of tool. They had a lot of this kind of stuff left. Um, and all of it's 80% off. That was originally $3.99 a piece. So I probably paid like 60 cents a pop for these. They're really, really shiny. And I just plan on um, like taking these and making a bow around all these boxes just so I make sure that none of the lids come off for next year and I can like tie a little um, like name tag on it so that's why I bought these. I got these. I thought they were so cute. They're like little salt and pepper shakers and they were originally $9.99 and they ended up being $2 for the entire package so I definitely got this. I thought it was so cute. I also got this plate. Um, it's actually like glass. It's not plastic or anything so it's the season. I would have never bought this at original price. It was originally $13.99. I would not pay $13.99 for a plate. So this ended up being like $2 and that, or maybe $3. That's more my price range. I was just going to like set this on my counter and put cookies on it around Christmas time or something. So I just thought it was, I thought it was cute. Okay, I have two more things and they are my favorite things that I bought. Um, this is one of them. They had two of these left over and what made me really sad was that the other one, like its antler was broke and they had it like taped to it um, in hopes that someone would buy it and fix it. Like I almost thought about it, but I didn't, I didn't know how to fix it. So I didn't buy the other one, but it's so cute. And it was originally $30. I would never pay $30 for this, but um, I have this like little sheet that I was like writing stuff down on. Um, so this was like $6 after the sale which is more my price range and then i got this this was the most expensive thing that i think i bought um it's super glittery i don't know if you can tell by the picture um but don't eat it don't eat it um but yeah it's it's so pretty it was originally 40 dollars, and i got it for eight dollars so this was one of my favorite finds today so yeah, if you have a Hobby Lobby near you and you want to decorate super cute for Christmas next year, I highly recommend going. They still had a lot of cute stuff left over, especially if you need new ornaments next year, if you need a new tree, anything like that. Now is the time to be buying that stuff. They had so many ornaments um, still left over, like, you know, like the big containers that like are all twirly inside. They had so many of those in different colors that were originally like $20 so you can get them for just like a few bucks. Um, best time right now is to stock up on all the Christmas stuff. So 
Um, and actually everything on my tree, except for that like little stocking that you see up there, all of my ornaments and everything came from Hobby Lobby. I obviously got them, I got them this year, so I, oh, for, I paid too much for them, but you can get them now for like super cheap. So, um, everything is 80% off. I don't know, every Christmas item is 80% off. I don't know, um, when they go 90% off, and to be honest, I don't really know if anything's going to be left over at 90% off, um, but you can always wait and see, but I do not plan on going shopping once it hits 90% off. Um, I might stop in there, but I don't think my store will really have anything left over. So yeah, this is the time to get the really, really cute stuff if you want it. Um, like I said, everything I showed you was $40 altogether. Um, and I probably saved like hundreds of dollars. Just one of those boxes themselves was $10 and I got like, I feel like I got like 15 boxes. I don't actually know how many I got, but that's how many I feel like I got. And then, um... Like I said, actually, everything that I paid would have only paid, like, if I would have paid regular price, what I should have paid for this is what I paid for everything in this video. So, um, yeah, highly, highly recommend going to Hobby Lobby right now if you want Christmas stuff. So, yeah, thanks for watching.